And if there the were, pardon? You should join the committee. Well, I was there that night. I thought I did join the committee. All right. Well, but I didn't hear anything. Nothing's Supervisor nothing's Martin. come to me. Well, what? I was going to let you finish all your comments, uh, Golden. I was going to try and answer. Wait a minute. I'm almost finished. Yep. How is? Um, uh, okay. Wait a minute. Number seven. I would like to come. I just noticed the screen that you put up in the corner there. I would like to come and show historic videos, and I'm hoping that you will approve that. I used to do that when uh, Raymond Skulky was here. He would bring in a, a camera, and uh, we would get uh, the town to say that this would be going on here at the uh, 8 o'clock or 7.30 or 7 o'clock for everybody to come and, 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 and see the video of at that time that I was showing. Well, what kind of videos, Golden? Well, I have historic videos. Right now, today I showed the assassination of Abraham Lincoln because this is Black Heritage Month, and I do the library exhibits, and it is Heritage Month, and um, it's also um, February is Lincoln's birthday, Washington's birthday, and Boy Scout Month. So my library exhibit is all on that. When I showed Lincoln's assassination today, put out by the History Channel, on Thursday I'll be at, um, at um, King Street Nursing Home, and I'll show it there, too. Wonderful. So there are a lot of things that I've shown. I've shown Glory, which stands for Washington and Morgan Freeman. Um, I've showed uh, Martin Luther King during January, uh, his biography. There's a lot of things I have uh, on history of this country. Well, uh, are you finished? Because I want to answer your points. Well, first of all, I want to thank you for your public spirit and, and public commitment. Well, I'm glad that I was able to come to this meeting. Exactly. I've been going to so many wakes and funerals that I'm, you know. Sure. Well, we haven't seen you for a while, so I'm, thank you for going. So, one, I'd love to uh, organize uh, a time for you to show your videos and ask you to work with Mr. Nowotnik, and we'll arrange uh, some times for you to do that. That would be uh, most welcome. That's Thank good. You for that. Will you Second, be able to do something about the concerts? Uh, well, I'm going to get. I'm going to go one by one. I'm going to go in order. Second thing is, okay. we'd love to get you on the Rye Town 350 Anniversary Committee and working with us. And, and just mark it in your calendar and people at home. March 25th, Thursday, March 25th at seven o'clock, is going to be our next function. Okay, wait a minute. Thursday, at March 25th three, at seven p.m. 7 p.m. At Crawford Park. Crawford Park. And we're going to then announce all the various activities for the whole of uh, this year. Okay. So we'll be handing out pamphlets with, with, with the various activities we're going to be doing. What's on March 18th, then? I have oh, to... sorry. It's been changed from March 18th to March 25th. Ah. It was originally... Thank you, Mr. Noto. You may have originally had it down as March 18th. Yeah, okay. It is now March 25th because there was a conflict. What time? 7 p.m. at Crawford Park. Okay. This is very nice what you did here. Thank you. It's Thanks very much. So, and we'd love to. We'll, I'll get in touch with you. Uh, would you leave your contact details with Bishop? And we'll let you know when the committee meetings are, so you can participate okay. in that. Thank you. Uh, the dog park uh, at, at, at Ryer Beach, Oakland Beach. It's uh, a new experiment. It won't be open during the summer. It's open until April. April is spring. Yeah. And it's very warm. A lot of people. I think April first. So and March thirty first is the last day. Okay, because I love dogs. I mean, I love sure. dogs, creatures, but well, what we did was don't mix we, depending upon the breed. Right. Well, that's that's you know, the, the, obviously the dog owners have to be responsible, right? Yeah. Well, I was there on Sunday actually mm -hmm. um, with my wonderful dog, uh, <laughs> well, that's Sebastian. Right. He's a wonderful a lab, yeah. but I must say, um, first of all, the dog owners do pick up uh, after their dogs on the beach, and there were at least a half dozen if not more um and it was really well done i mean the dogs were fine they ran around no one no one was Maybe bothered by no 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 how about know. donations are we getting any donations uh are you looking for donations no there's a donation box down there i didn't see it i was there you mean after town attorney noto was there there were still no donations <laughs> uh, not that i was looking to hand out money but uh you know there's a what sign. would you do? Put it in the box and hope no one's stealing it? I don't know. I, I don't know. How's it working? There's a sign for them to call. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How secure is that? We haven't gotten any calls. Okay. Um, no, anyway, but so that's an experiment. I'm, I'm glad to hear it's working fairly well. Uh, in terms of your idea about concerts, uh, we'll look to get 
more concerts at Oakland Beach, but I love your idea of a concert series at Crawford Park. So, Mr. Nemotnik, would you see about organizing a concert series in, uh, at Crawford Park? And, and one of the things as part of our Rye 350 uh, we're thinking of doing is having local musicians from the Rye Town community. And so... Yeah, that's what I wanted to tell you. I'm on the entertainment committee with Andrew Bino. Okay. And um, I go to a lot of musical concerts because I love music. Music is key. It gives me my exercise. <laughs> And uh, I've been to uh, Latino concerts and uh, all kinds of concerts, right. and I keep getting the cards. And I keep giving them to uh, Tom or to um, Carol, hoping that they'll have some of those concerts come, you know, and play for us. But I also go to St. Peter's, which is right here, and they have loads of Latino music yep. going on. <clears throat> A lot of Latino people coming and playing music, and it's incredible. It's incredible. Cool. You're of course aware of all the terrific uh, concerts in Lions Park each summer, correct? Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, You're aware of the terrific concerts that the Port Chester Direct Department puts on well, in Lions Park? Well, that's out in the Rec Department. We right. do it in the marina, and we right. do it at Lion Park. Right. Yeah. Well, let's, so let's coordinate with the Village of Port Chester to have... At Oakland Beach and yeah. Crawford. That's, yeah, because it's a wonderful place for it. So let's, that's a yeah. wonderful suggestion. Yeah. Let me... Now, I want to thank you for coming. We're already executing, hopefully, on two years' suggestions. Uh, the cumulative voting, I'll leave that to Port Chester. Uh, but what I, the last thing on tax... I don't think it's going to affect us. We're going to, uh, you know, help facilitate the election by, I think, using the town facilities to get uh, the election. I think what they're talking about doing is having the election. Uh, you can vote before Election Day. <clears throat> so I think the booths will be open two weeks yes, ahead. No, this will be in June. No, I see, but I'm saying I think they're, whatever the election date is, I think the idea is to keep, have, uh, let, four people that, uh, uh, exactly, a whole week, exactly. <laughs> so I think it would help with that, but, and I, you know, look, I want to, we're committed to voter participation. I have my views on the cumulative voting, the lawsuit, quite frankly, I think the lawsuit was egregious. I think it was wholly unfair. Unfair. And, and I don't like community voting either, but you that's water under the bridge. You know okay. Well, it's not. well, I don't want to get into a debate. On okay, the, I'll tell you later. Yep. And then the last thing is taxes. You know, uh, one thing I, you know, as you go to these other town boards, I'd like you to, you know, when you come up and say there's a problem with taxes, there's one government's reduced taxes two years in a row, or three years in a row, in fact, and that's this government. And we're going to, I'm very confident, we'll eliminate the town tax over the course of the next one or two years. So I think this government, more than anybody, has been uh, responsive uh, to what you're talking about. And I hopefully we'll, hopefully we'll continue to do that. So thank you for your comments. Thanks for your participation. Any other uh, comments from the public? Okay. Um, <clears throat> let's move to our agenda then. We have a fairly heavy agenda. I guess we need to... Uh, appoint certain people into certain positions. So the first thing is we need to appoint uh, Bishop Nwatnik to Director of Purchasing. Anybody have any questions, comments? Is he the current Director of Purchasing? Yes. <laughs> yes, sir. I, I propose that we approve the appointment by acclamation. Okay. Need a second. What does that mean? That we, we call will raise our hands. Oh, you raise our hands? At one. Well, we need a second okay. according to the town attorney. <laughs> need a second. Yeah. A, a second. motion and a second. Then you can. Second. second. Okay. We'll just go like this then? Uh, okay. call it. All, all in favor, <laughs> all favor, raise your hand. <laughs> we'll all raise their hand. Okay, vital statistics. Registrar of Vital Statistics uh, for uh, Town oh. Clerk of Espia. Can we get a? I, I, move, I move that we uh, vote by acclamation to approve Ms. Vespia's. Second. Second. Okay. Second. No. Oh. Right. We'll Town Park Board Member uh, Benny Salonitro. <clears throat> Benny's done an absolutely fantastic job. He's an engineer, a civil engineer. He works in the village of Scarsdale. And he's been very, very helpful to us on the Rye Town Park Board. Uh, he also uh, hails from the Rye Neck community. As you know, one of our efforts is to uh, make sure all three of our communities is, are, are uh, represented here on the board. Uh, and so uh, we wanted to approve him. Can I uh, get a motion to approve uh, Benny Salonitra as Rye Town Park Board member? So moved. Second. Second. I uh, hope you want to call the roll. Aye. 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 Aye